Welcome back to my brand new After Effects tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to create Black Adam movie title animation. Create a new composition with 1920 by 1080 resolution. Now import your logo and drag it to the timeline. Select the layer, go to layer, auto trace and check this apply to new layer. Then click on OK. Now delete the logo and unhide the auto trace logo. Right click and create a new solid layer. and apply element 3d from video copilot open custom layers custom text and mask and change this path layer to your logo layer now go to scene setup and click on extrude now go to presets in physical bevels apply the first bevel on the logo select this scale and increase the z scale like this Select the model and set UV mapping to 5x5. Now open the model and apply some metal textures from pro shaders to pack. Now apply this environment. Hold shift and drag to adjust the environment. Now select the middle bevel, select extrude to 0.84 and expand it just to minus 3. Then click on OK. Right click here and create a new parallel light. Set color to white and adjust the position. So that light falls on the edges of the letters. Create a new point light. Set color to light blue. Place it here. Create one more point light with orange color. And push the light into Z space so that light falls from the back. Select the element, open group 1, particle replicator, open rotation, set x rotation to minus 2. Open render settings, open shadow and turn on the shadow. And turn on the ambient occlusion. Duplicate the point light and change the position. Create a new solid layer and place it above element layer. and hide it. Make sure the layer is selected. Now select the pen tool and draw the mask as shown.
now unhide the layer and apply saber effect from video copilot now change preset to mist in customize score change core type to layer mask change the blending mode to add and set color to orange Now create a new camera Select the saber layer Go to around 1 second Decrease the start size Then add a keyframe on start offset Make it 100% Press you to see keyframes Go to 3 seconds and make it 0% Adjust the glow spread and glow bias Add a keyframe on glow intensity and I will gradually decrease the intensity Now select all keyframes, right click and easy is them. Now select these two keyframes, go to graph editor and adjust the graph as shown. Now create a new solid layer and apply saber effect Apply the same color on the new saber effect If you have optical flares plugin you can use that Press T and add a keyframe, make it 0. Go around 1 second and make it 100%. Change mode to add. Now create a new solid layer and place it above element. Now select this ellipse tool and draw the mask and invert it. Increase the feather of the mask. Then add a keyframe on mask path. Set the mask position to where the saber effect will start. Now gradually increase the mask.
keep on increasing till it reveals the entire logo. Now select all the keyframes and select easy ease. Now create a new adjustment layer, apply unsharp mask and set amount to 100%. Apply curves and set the curves as shown. Create a new composition, set height to 8 value to get the cinematic look. Now drag the title composition to timeline. Make the layer 3D, create a new null object and make it 3D as well. Go to end of your timeline and add a keyframe on position. Don't forget to pan this layer to the null object. Now increase the Z position and drag the keyframe to start. This will add a nice zoom in effect. Select both the keyframes and ease ease them. Now press 0 to ramp preview. You change the text. Open the title composition and create a new text layer and hide it. In custom layer, change the path to the new text layer. To adjust the mask, select the layer and turn off the effects on the saber effect. Now adjust the mask according to your text. Here I am slightly decreasing the opacity of the lens flare. This is how we can change the text. Make sure to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching this video.